Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how to add additional maps to your Roborock Robovac, for instance, if you live in a multi-level home. So what we want to do is launch the Roborock application. And from here, you're going to select your robot vacuum that you'd like to add maps to. If you haven't already linked up your Robovac to the app, you can do so through the little plus icon after you've downloaded the app. But selecting my Robovac right here, that takes me over to this map page. So it has the initial map the main level of my house, but now I have my RoboVac upstairs. So I wanted to create a map for the second floor. You can see that I have this line here. I tried to click start and thought maybe it would create the map on its own, but it did not do that. So to set this up, what we want to do is click on the options menu here, clicking these three little dots in the upper right hand corner. And then from our settings menu, we want to scroll down until you find where it says manage maps and click on that. And you can see from here, you want to select in the home layout area, multi-level. I was selected on single level, so it was only doing one map, but then I changed it over to multi-level. And then once doing that, you can see I now have the option to create a new map. So this is the main level of my home. Now the RoboVac is in the second floor, so I want to create a map for that. So clicking the plus icon there, and then I'm going to click clean and mapping. And with my robot vacuum in the second story of my home, it's now getting going, cleaning that area, and it will map out that second map, the second story of my home. So this is the process you go about to create an additional map for your robot vacuum. And again, you do that through selecting the robot vac that you want to create multiple maps for, going up, clicking on your settings, and then in our settings menu, what we can do is go down to manage maps. And you just want to make sure that your home layout is multi-level so that you can create additional maps. And this is how you can go about doing that. So I hope this video is helpful going over how to add additional maps with your Roborock RoboVac. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and I'll see you back here next time.